Well, well. <laughs> Why well. am I nervous to do this? Because <laughs> you know we're gonna get cancelled no. if we say something bad about certain games. <laughs> we must set the metal killings near Barfella. <laughs> But just because we know you will bitch yeah. if we don't put it in S, we're gonna put it in D. Yeah. Depending okay. Okay. The rules. We have to agree on a tier together. Oh god. Oh no, we gotta stay here in a fucking day. Yes. Mm-hmm. Starting with a way out. It was very sad. It yeah. was sad. <laughs> It was a good game. Yeah, it, it was very sad. The I story was... is really good. Like the game has really good writing. Mm. Yeah, and it the really twist fucked you up. The twist and yeah. fuck in the end fucks you I up. I would say yeah. A. It's good, but not you know high high. Yeah, yeah. But sometimes it could be very stressful. <laughs> <laughs> the quick times. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking truck. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> oh, god. Oh, god. <laughs> the car chase was hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> But, like, out of all co-op games I've ever played, I would place it very high. Yeah, yeah. same. Because uh, A Way Out is actually built to be a co-op game. Like, you can't yeah. play it alone. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's, it's like, yeah. built around that so it's a co-op well. game. Yeah. Yeah. And that's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I would place A Way Out as an A. Yeah. Just based on all other co-op games I've played. Mm. Or... Ark Survival Evolved <laughs> is a game that I hate uh, and also <laughs> love. <laughs> it Maze? sucks to grind up to the yeah. point where I am in the game. Um, it takes hours. Like, how many hours do I have on Ark currently? I have uh, almost 400 hours oh, of God. gameplay. What the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and when I, did you get the game? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, like, Ark is really good if you can play in, like, a tribe. Yeah. yeah. But, uh, alone, you know... Alone... Yeah. Alone, it's... It gets sad. Yeah, it's so sad to see the dinosaurs die randomly. <laughs> what did you guys think when we were taming the T-Rex? Uh, it was... <laughs> for the video. Stressful. <laughs> it was scary, but... Once we did it, it was... Um... A little boring. Oh yeah, there was that uh, giant tick T-Rex that fucking jump scared yeah. us too. Oh yeah, <laughs> like that was fun, but after it was kind of meh. I would play or play Ark in like uh, maybe C or B. I f- e or C. I'm between like B or C, so maybe C. Yeah, we all mm. have C in our answer at least. Yeah. Yeah, let, let's settle for C. Like, it's good, but it's not for, like... Yeah. It has some flaws. Yeah, it has flaws. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's played in saucer. Walking uh... is uh, absolute shit. <laughs> <laughs> and it makes me disher- dizzy as fuck. <laughs> but uh, when you watch it, someone else plays it, it's super hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> it's in such an early state. Yeah, Blade and Sorcery is like, it's still in early access, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. Like, it, they're still developing it, like, you can't do much with the main game yet, yeah. but it's still, like, really fun. And, I mean, the mods are really, the mod community is fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I would put it at S if the game was complete. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah. But now maybe a B or something? <laughs> I might place it at A. I would also a. place it at A. Explain, okay. Michaela. Why you <laughs> think it should be in B? Why should it be in B? <laughs> B, B, B. Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Because I don't think you can do that much, you know. Oh, uh, yeah, good yeah. point. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, you have a good weapon selection, but it, there's not a lot of variety to the enemies. Yeah. Mm. Exactly. I, yeah. I okay, I would. Yeah, I would. I win! Yeah, yeah. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. And, uh, oh shit, here comes your favorite. It's Camp Marshmallow. Oh my god. <laughs> good memories. Such a long time ago. Yeah. Good memories, good memories. Early Misa YouTube content. Yes. <laughs> 
it's so simple but so disturbing. Yeah, yeah it's like <laughs> it was really sad. It has yeah. such a simple like message in a way. Yeah. <laughs> it, it was it was very disturbing. I didn't like the kids being all cryptic when you fed them the marshmallows. Yeah. <laughs> they looked a bit cursed. Oh yeah, and it was the rude marshmallow that oh, yeah. still fucked oh, yeah. you. <laughs> and the one that like the died. one that, the one that cried. <laughs> died looking at the stars. Yeah. Very poetic death. Yeah, yeah. I died while you can look at down the final seconds before you die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think I would place it in C. Yeah, I agree. Catherine. Oh jeez. Like, it handles some very heavy topics. Mm. Yeah. Especially yeah. with the addition in full body with uh, Rin. Yeah, yeah. Rin. Which we couldn't get to because YouTube could... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, but Rin's story really, like, fleshed out Vincent in my way. Yeah, it fleshes and, out know. Vincent a lot as a character, which is why I'm mad we couldn't get to that on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and it, later on with his relationship with Rain really like, evolved in a way that I'm not gonna spoil mm. because you know. People were critical about Rin's character, but like. I liked Rin. I yeah, think so. Rin's story added a lot to Vincent as a person. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. really good. I would give the story an A. Mm. The puzzles are a bit annoying sometimes. The gameplay, I would give a B. Yeah. Mm. But. Like, I think the store is so good, it probably elevates it from a B. Yeah. Because, yeah. Because, you know, it's... It, yeah, I think so, too. You can watch the story and be very content. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I would rank Catherine as an A. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you drink again. Christmas in VR. Oh, my God, yes. Uh... <laughs> it was a funny glitchy game because it it had better physics than i thought it would yeah. <laughs> it was pretty basic you know yeah it, yeah. Was, it yeah. was basic it wasn't bad it wasn't no super good i mean it was funny i wouldn't put it that high yeah i wouldn't put it high because it's maybe like c <laughs> it's c i think it's fair because it... you can't do a lot in it no like you only decorate a tree that's yeah. it <laughs> but i don't know compared to arc and Camp Marshmallow, maybe. it should be lower, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah maybe. Like, yeah, this might be the first D. Yeah, yeah. yeah. not because it's bad, but because yeah, it's the other D. games are better, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Colorful. So, uh, what do it's you... It's only a... Yeah, this is the it's demo. demo. Yeah. Yeah. So... It's, like, it's, um, uh, uh, what's it, it called? It has questionable uh, characters in Otome it. game. Yeah, Otome visual novel. Yeah. Like, I had a lot of fun playing. Yeah, same. <laughs> it was funny. It was really fun just voicing the characters and shit. Yeah. <laughs> it, it has potential to be something really good. Yeah. Like, I like the artwork. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's very a very unique. distinct art. Yeah. For yes. a demo, it's really good. I think it's yeah. set up the characters pretty yeah. well. Yeah, same. I really like Danny. But that's it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's better than Blade and Sorcery, but it's not... Nah. <laughs> I wouldn't want to put it at, you know, the lowest, because no. it's a good game. Yeah. yeah. It's a good visual novel. It's a good yeah. visual. So I would I, put Colorful, like, in between. Yeah. yeah. Ark and Camp, and Camp Marshmallow. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah uh, Cooking Simulator oh VR. Oh my god. <laughs> One of our super early vids. Yep. <laughs> Where it's the still... audio was way too fucking loud, you can barely hear us, fucking Yoshu is there. <laughs> it's a whole mess. <laughs> like, out of the VR games I play alone, this is the one I play the most. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I really like Cooking Simulator. Yeah, it's a I, fun, I, like, yeah, sandbox. It's a fun yeah, sandbox. <laughs> man, where's my gourmet pan? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where's the salt? <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> I, I would place Cooking Simulator VR as a, at a B. Yeah. With Blade and Sorcery. I think it's above Blade and Sorcery. Mm. Would you put it above 
Catherine? I would. You would? I would. I, I think I would put it before even a way out. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Like, I'm a sucker for, like, cooking games. Uh, I, 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 I understand that, but <laughs> I personally I, like story more. Yes, it, yeah. Like, so I I'm going to fight you for that one. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Like... You can't explode an egg in a microwave. <laughs> and that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like... No, son, it's not going to go before a way It's out. not going to go before a way out. <laughs> And I don't no. think it's gonna go before Catherine either. Like, I you can't, would, you I can't think, fuck with stories, I, I think it's better than Catherine, in a way. It's not better than The Way Out. It's no, not, I don't agree. I, <laughs> it's two against one, we're putting it in between. Yeah, no! Yeah, 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 yeah. How can a fucking cooking game be better than Catherine? It's funny, okay? You can fucking explode characters. I don't care. It's a story, what the fuck? <laughs> you got to be more often inclined to play cooking simulator than Catherine. You can burn down the whole kitchen. <laughs> You're going to be more inclined yeah. to play that game before Catherine. That's the only yeah. way. Like, you can only... A way out is better, objectively. Yeah. Be. But, like, if you're alone, yeah. like Sana is sometimes. <laughs> Always this girl. Yeah, she, <laughs> she's gonna play cooking something later. Okay, fine. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, here comes Death and Taxes, oh which we, me and Amanda don't have an opinion on. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> don't it's me. I mean, it's pretty simple, like, in a way. Mm -hmm. Like, you pretty much choose who fucking dies, basically. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, probably put it in C. In C? Yeah. Is it before any of them, or after? What do you think? <laughs> I think um, maybe before. Or marshmallow, just because mm -hmm. it has different endings. Uh, yeah, yeah. You think uh, colorful is better? Mm, I <laughs> enjoyed it more. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Delta Rune. <laughs> like it was a very... much more funnier character in, in Undertale than Delta Rune. Delta Rune was a very like. They were kind of uh, odd. I don't, I don't really know. I... remember anyone except yeah. what the fuck is his name? Uh, the little. Uh... I don't know where Toby Fox is going with Deltarune because mm. he started off saying that it was gonna be like something different from Undertale, but now it looks like it's like trying to tie into Undertale or that it's like an AU. And there's like compared to Undertale, there's so much more like new like lore <laughs> that yeah. you have to keep track of in Deltarune. It has like... You have to study? It's like a big... Yeah, you have to study mm -hmm. for Deltarune. That's right. what I don't like. Yeah, I like... I like. I don't want to wanna think. <laughs> I don't want to like, think. I like play. studying lore. It's a very fun. But I did not like the lore I had The to soundtrack study. is still mm -hmm. great. Yeah, the soundtrack is no. good. It's hard to remember what, yeah. what happened. Yeah. <laughs> like... Maybe one day we can, when all the chapters are, are out, my our... god, my voice cracked yeah, like yeah. fucking Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> Anthropology? <What>? Anthropology? <laughs> yeah, but... but maybe when... one day when they release, they, I mean, Toby releases the chapters, like all of them, maybe we mm. can sit down and play them all. Yeah. And yeah, maybe yeah. we will feel differently about it. Yeah. But at the moment, I would actually put it at Day? Mm. I know! <laughs> I just don't... I don't feel inclined to mm. playing it. Yeah, like, like I would on, probably also place it at D, but like, I'm scared. On, on. <laughs> okay, yes. It's Devil May Cry 5. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's... I don't even have anything to say. It's S. Yes, it's the best game I played last year. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's one of those games that are easy for like beginners. Uh, beginners. Yeah, it's very into. beginner friendly. Yeah. Like, 
like I saw V's face and was like, ew. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now it's like, oh. Shut up. My baby. Yeah, yeah. no. <laughs> uh, all right. Nero is uh, awesome, he's uh, really cute. Yeah, he's a cute little boy. Dante's fucking insane. Yeah. Virgil's hot. <laughs> Questionable. Um, v isn't. Uh, and she then... likes it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. yeah like, it's yeah, it's, no, it's no argument, it is. Yeah, so. I'm not gonna argue. <laughs> yeah. Is it something. If you have the option, I would place it in S uh, for fucking devil trigger alone. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay, first S rank, and now we're on doodle dates. Doodle dates. Which we have no opinion on. Oh it. my god, it's. Okay, listen. <laughs> if you like to draw, <laughs> it's a fun I game, I think. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um. And it's fun that you can like make your own characters, <laughs> and uh, yeah, you I could. think the story changes. Like so that is you don't get the same story. <laughs> that, that is that actually is one of our funniest older videos. Yeah, in my opinion, just me <laughs> fucking around. Yeah. <laughs> like it looked very fun. I remember like, the yeah. sad yeah. Ignis you drew. Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> hilarious! It's so fun. Yeah, so it's very simple, but it's fun. <laughs> yeah. Um, and it has like multiple endings, but I think it's one of those games like you play it once or twice and then you never touch it again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So where would you uh, put it? Probably put it before Death and Taxes. No. Okay, so no. after Colorful. Yeah. But before yeah. Death yeah. 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 yeah, I think that's a good <laughs> yeah, yeah. place oh, for God. it. I had a lot of fun with it. But I'm probably not gonna play yeah. it again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Epic roller coasters. It doesn't do much. It's a VR roller coaster. Mm. You're. It's fun the first time, but then the next is like. Uh. I would put it oh. at D. Same. I can't even play it because I'm scared of heights, <laughs> yeah. so yeah. I can't <laughs> say anything. So maybe it should be uh, after the Christmas decoration. Yeah, I you think could so. Actually I could at least play it. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, here we go. It's, oh no. It's face your fears. This is another one of those VR games where you just sit. Yeah. And you view things. It has more impressive visuals than Epic Roller Coaster. <laughs> mm. I would put it F. A D. Yeah, I would probably t place it in D. Yeah. yeah. Like, it's not F better than the Christmas decoration. <laughs> it's so ugly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, I agree. Christ Christmas was funnier. Yeah. And I also placed it low because every fucking jump scare was the stupid kid. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> the fucking kid jumping out of the stupid <laughs> box. Yeah. Flying aces, you, you just crashed the plane, and that was it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this was you, Amanda. It's God of War. I liked Baldur. Yeah, Baldur is <laughs> like a bitch, but you know. You can't beat me! <laughs> yeah. Like, he's a whiny little asshole, but he's funny. Yeah. You can't Objectively. hurt me! <laughs> when you're not playing against him, he's very funny. Yeah. So when I watch back, <laughs> I enjoy what I am seeing. Yeah. When I'm playing, I do not enjoy what I'm seeing. <laughs> it's fun to see the Nordic gods. Yeah, it's very yeah. fun to see their depiction of the Nordic gods. I would, <laughs> I would put it before a way out. <sighs> because I find it very like fun. There. So a. a. Mm. A it's above all else. else. Gray. Oh, I can barely see what the fuck that is. Yeah, it's, it's the, it's the big, big guy. Oh. Yeah, it was like, made by a student? Yeah, it was yeah. made as someone's college project, I yeah. think. Yeah, and that's impressive. I don't think it's better than Blade and Sorcery. It's a horror game, so I'm more inclined to like, yeah. mm. like it. <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's better than Blade and Sorcery, though. No. No, it has that more would put potential. It at B. So. Yeah. It's another game where it's like, yeah, it has potential to be great. And... Mm, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, I think I would put it at C before yeah. R. Yeah. yeah. B seems a little high for mm. uh, such a short yeah. game. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Hello Puppets. That one I played alone. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's very short, but, you know, not as short as the others. It has good atmosphere. It's a humorous horror game. Like, it, 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 there are some funny moments. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. I think I would place it at C tier, though. Mm-hmm. Okay. Because if we go to the top tier VR games, like Cooking Sim and Blade and Sorcery, like, it, it doesn't r- quite reach that high. Yeah. yeah. Because the visuals aren't as impressive. Mm. And the gameplay is kind of simple. So I would place it above grey, actually. It's Crazy. it's spooky puppets. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and that's kind of... It's kind of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Into the parish. Oh yeah. I don't really. It was remember so it. hard to fucking get a gun and load. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Reload. That was. <laughs> yeah. Where we fucking saying the wolf is sleeping in the oh, yeah. <laughs> forest. Or yeah. Something. The forest. The spooky forest. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It has potential because the visuals are interesting. Mm. In my opinion, that's what drew me to the game. But it's very janky, it's like not complete. I can't place it very high. It, no. it, it didn't really spooky. give you. We directive, didn't get far right? because yeah. the game like broke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. The first like The enemies froze. We couldn't load mm. the gun. Yeah. <laughs> we couldn't we pick up the gun. The oh yeah. <laughs> uh, I would probably place it I think. D. Yeah. In D. Dismal. But maybe before uh, the kid or something. Yeah, it's more ambitious than uh, flying aces and epic roller coaster and uh, and face uh, your face your fears in my opinion. Yeah, yeah. and maybe because the tree it had vo- decorating too. Yeah, because yeah. it had voice acting, it had music. It, you know. it was not better than Delta Room. No, so. it's not. Uh. Job simulator. It was fun. It good. Yeah, I think <laughs> it's better than Cooking Simulator. <gasps> e. Because you can do more in that yeah, game. Yeah, I agree, I agree. I'm not, I'm not arguing with that. Mm. Yeah, like, yeah, like I remember it's... being in the office and working on cars. Like the restaurant. Yeah. <laughs> and then fucking around with snow. <laughs> I think. No, that's vacation. So oh, so, sorry. Fun. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's coming later. Okay. <laughs> like the like restaurant was. Oh yeah. Like we. Yeah, job is a uh, restaurant, uh, car, uh, office. Oh, the office is so fucking fun. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I think there's another one. Oh, uh, when store. Oh yeah, the, yeah, the, the store. The, the quickie mart. Yeah. <laughs> quickie mart. <laughs> yeah, I like it more than cooking simulator. Yeah. yeah. But that's my opinion. I agree with that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I f- yeah. Yeah. Like, it, it is a top-tier VR game. I would put yeah. it over in Cooking Soon. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But would I put it over A Way Out? It's kind of hard to compare mm. a VR game to, like, a normal one, I think. Yeah. yeah. That's it's what... impressive for a <laughs> VR game, you know? Yeah, I think I'm putting it, it, it next to A Way Out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, you don't want to fight me on this. <laughs> this no, no. Well, now we might start fighting. Yakuza Kiwami 2. Oh, oh, oh. But we haven't gone that far. Yeah, we haven't gotten that far, yeah. but... I'd okay, like... Kiwami 2, I would place at B, because it, it's fucking Yakuza. It has fucking Kiryu-chan. It has the, the fucking... The, the funniest... It has funny physics. It had <laughs> fucked up physics that were hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> it, it was very funny physics. It's yeah. not like physics that you're like, oh, that's weird. It had like ghost simulator physics. It yeah. was very funny. Yeah. <laughs> but since we haven't played that far in the game, I can't place it higher than B. Yeah, yeah same. I'd probably place it like pro, like S or A if I knew the rest. Yeah. yeah. Because I know Majima's coming. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I would if- put it at B, but maybe before Blade and Sorcery. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As I said, you can't fight with story. <laughs> <laughs> you can, in some cases. <laughs> no. Some. Yakuza Kiwami. 
The first one. That one we have finished. I would place it as... Um, I would put it in this. Yeah. I, I fucking love this story. There's fucking Majima and he's everywhere. I know. And I know. there's fucking karaoke. There's tiger dropping. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like the game too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you like it more than uh, the Devil May Cry though? No. <laughs> <laughs> It gets is just because Majima. <laughs> <laughs> Sam power. <laughs> the power of the Sam. Uh, yeah. Yeah, um, yeah, but it's a good game. Yeah, yeah it, it's I, good. I can't like, argue, you know. Oh, the furry shit. Uh, yeah, the Cuddle kobold. What the fuck, Sana, did you download? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, okay, listen, listen, <laughs> listen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I am listening. Listen. <laughs> yeah. It was the top ranked Christmas VR game on itch. <laughs> it's very <laughs> suspicious. <sighs> yep. <laughs> so I downloaded it yep. for us to play. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I'm not arguing that you downloaded it. <laughs> I mean, visually it looks good. Yeah, yeah. Looks I think, like... yeah. I don't know if I want to play the full game when it's no, out. No. <laughs> We're not gonna do that. <laughs> because the tags on itch were... Um... Questionable? Yeah. <laughs> mm. I would put it... D. Yeah, same. Uh, minus points that you couldn't drown it. <laughs> yep. And it has to be good to death. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it gets D. Deltarune is still A. It's still better. Yeah, it, yeah. it would be an insult to put it over there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Amanda, what's your opinion on Last Labyrinth? <laughs> Chicken game maniac with giraffe. I hate him. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> the giraffe. We were gonna put it in B. I can agree with that. I think I would la rank it behind Blade and Sorcery. Mm -hmm. You would? Yeah, yeah, because Blade and Sorcery utilizes VR a little bit more. Mm. With like climbing and jumping and fighting. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. While Last Labyrinth, it's very simple gameplay wise. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're you set the point. Yeah, you're pointing at where you want the little girl to go. Mm. And I don't like the math levels. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The it has math. math. <laughs> my giraffe. <laughs> my giraffe. I hate but it, that it is a good giraffe. VR game. Yeah. yeah. It's like a hidden gem. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Here's my hot opinion. <laughs> I think the below God of War. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because God War has the story and But the know, memes the memes are fun, <laughs> but like I would put it highest in A tier. Mm -hmm. It's a big problem <laughs> where you're like I can see both but Yeah but I'm kinda I with a man. <laughs> I don't like that kind of genre myself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Which is very odd because they have very similar genres. But yeah. I don't like the... Like, like, the reason I won't put Metal Gear in S tier is because I don't sit down and play it like, in my free time. Yeah. yeah. It's more fun to play it with like you guys. Yeah. yeah. And I the visuals like are super impressive despite being a decade old. Yeah. yeah. The soundtrack is great, that's also why I would put it higher than God of War. Yeah, mm. <laughs> like, I was, when you consider it, God of War came out in 2018. It's super, yeah. it's super cool. But it came out in 2013. Yeah. Mm, true. It makes it even more impressive. Yeah. Yeah. The voice acting might be a little... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, maybe it's not sad. But it has, you know, Sam. Thanks. Probably A tier. Yeah, A tier. <laughs> because I enjoyed I can, I, I the can... other two, like Devil May Cry and Yakuza more. Yeah. 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 I can probably... The story like, in those I... two games are way higher. The, the yeah. emotions are higher in Devil May Cry and Kiwami. Yeah. I can probably be persuaded to put it above God and War. God and War. <laughs> it's not... As good as 
Devil May Cry and yeah. the simping power of the Yakuza <laughs> yeah. up there. So yeah. uh, I think we should put it before because we haven't played much of God of War. Yeah. Yeah. It so it's hard to change. judge. It. Yeah, it might change. Yeah, God of War might change once we like get finished in. Yeah. yeah. Because I know the basic story, so I, that's why I think it's mm. you know, better. Mm. Yeah. Because I know, you know. I don't like, know everything. I know the that's story. That's the thing with Metal It was very ahead of its time. Yeah. It, like, it has aged really well. Yeah. With, the, like, our modern day culture. Yeah. yeah. Like, because back in the day, people were looking at characters like Monsoon and be like, oh, yeah, he's so deep and philosophical. And now everybody's just laughing at him yeah. being a fucking edgelord. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, and Sam can double jump. Yeah, yeah. That, mm-hmm. yeah, Kratos can't double jump. <laughs> Kratos can't fucking double jump. <laughs> he can't double jump for him. He can half jump. Uh-huh. Merlin VR. Oh, the, the French, oh, that's what it was. The, the French, French game. <laughs> we didn't understand shit because only Amanda knows French. Uh, yeah, and I didn't, I didn't play it because you played it. Yeah. So I had to... <laughs> Quickly translate. <laughs> yeah. It was really fun, but it's a very bare game. Yeah, mm. it was very pretty. I think I would put it between epic roller coasters and flying aces. Yeah. 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 Fair enough. Because it was at least funnier than flying aces. Yeah, at least you could do more in Merlin VR. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, it's my hero holiday. <laughs> oh yeah, um, the old Tom again. <laughs> the only fun thing was, you know, us just implementing Aizawa. Oh a yeah, friend. You have a boyfriend. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Like, we didn't even get a kiss. We didn't even get a kiss, man. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't get a kiss at colorful, but we. we but that's a demo. That's it's a, a demo. demo. We, we might get a kiss. Yeah. We might get a kiss. We might get strong. <laughs> get it from hey, Fabian. I hope Ew. not. <laughs> D. Yeah. I would place it the lowest. Yes. Yeah. It's like even the crashing game. <laughs> you just sat there and read a fanfic. Yeah, yeah basically. Okay, oh, daddy. Oh my god. Damn. <laughs> it's super fun to play co-op on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't want to play. And fuck around, you're gonna have a good time. <laughs> yeah. Especially co op, because one arm will do everything, and then the other is like, I'm not calling names. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd place Octo Daddy B. Yeah, yeah. Uh, at the, the, the last, last place in B. Yeah. Gosh. I don't know if I would put it F. Labyrinth. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not. Math. Like, you have to enjoy like horror to like. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I think I could. Labyrinth, I, think. I could place it above Last Labyrinth, but not Blade and Sorcery. Yeah. <clears throat> oh shit! The Paper Man. <laughs> Paper man, don't come for me, please. I really like the paper man. Yeah. <laughs> it fucked me up. <laughs> yeah. It's a super simple VR horror game, but it was super effective because the sound design was really good. Yeah. <laughs> I like the design of paper man. It's not A or S, definitely no. not. <laughs> Maybe B, honestly. Yeah. I don't think it's C. Mm-hmm. It's not that. It's a good game. Yeah, I think it's Better than all of the ones in yeah. C. Papetura? I'm not sure Papetura? how it's put pa- now. Papetura? Papetura? Pa- 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 the person who made this game made it by hand. Like oh all the characters. Oh. Yeah, like the whole s- like setting is yeah. made out of real paper, you know? Oh, my oh God. that's so cool. Yeah. Creepy but way. it's like one of those <laughs> weird games, like. <laughs> mm-hmm. Like it doesn't really tell you a story, it's more visually. Yeah. Yeah. We've yeah. played a lot of those games. Yeah. I'm yeah. realizing that now. Because we like this type of game. It I seems guess. like we like that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I I had a lot of fun playing yeah. it, so I would probably put it 
C tier. C way uh, first. Yeah. First. Yeah. I can agree. Yeah, and, because and it's so much effort in it, you know. Yeah. yeah. Penumbra Overture, also one of our super early videos. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> Penumbra, like compared to Amnesia, it's really fun because there's combat. So it was in the second Penumbra game they dropped the weapon system. Okay. Yeah. So in my opinion, Overture is the better one of the two because mm. you could creatively like take down enemies. Mm. Mm. I would put Penumbra Overture in like yeah. Uh, honestly in S tier, but uh, I will tone it down a bit and put it in A tier. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> From the game, right? it, It's a really old game, yeah. Yeah. so the visuals don't look like super great or anything. Yeah. Mm. But I would still put it in A because I think it holds up still. Yeah. yeah. I would probably put it between A Way Out and God of War. Get, yeah. get her! <laughs> <laughs> VR treatment pho- phobia VR treatment yeah. yeah it was scary but for the wrong reasons yeah I did not like the doctor yeah that's why I put yeah. a master <laughs> thumbnail yeah like the doctor was very strange and I would place it in D yeah, yeah see. after epic roller coasters it's yeah. 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 There was still more to do than in Merlin VR and Flying Aces yeah. and <laughs> My Hero Holiday. Yeah. 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 Santa's corpse is coming to town. <laughs> Pixel Slenderman. Yeah. yeah. But, but Slenderman is Santa and yeah. he's dead. Yeah. Ho ho ho, <laughs> Slenderman. Yeah. The intro was probably my favorite part. Like the main gameplay wasn't. <laughs> Yeah. No, you just run around. You run around and Pixel Santa comes and be like, Oogie boogie boogie. Yeah. <laughs> Not in C. Nah. But high in D. Yeah. Hmm. After I f- Death the Rune? Yeah, because I think it has like the same shit as the. the yeah, it's similar to the Cuddle dra- Cobalt. Yeah. <laughs> but not as cursed. Yeah. <laughs> I enjoyed it more. Uh, d- Santa or Santa. that one? <laughs> Santa. <laughs> Scorn. It's beautiful. Mm. Yeah, it's, yeah. But it is the gameplay that drags it down, mm. unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> because the first... I We have talked about this in private and we see the game as like... It has three parts. And the first part is the best one. Yeah. Mm. And that's the part where you free the, either free or murder that the little poor guy in the fucking <laughs> egg. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that part was fucking gut wrenching and it fucking hurt my soul. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But then the next parts in the game, you're just killing everything you fucking encounter, so you don't feel the same way anymore. Yeah. It yeah. kind of ruins the start a little bit. Mm. Yeah. You don't feel like that had as much of an impact anymore. The shooting in the game. Uh... <laughs> the sh- fucking. Was, sh- yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it was not good. <laughs> I could have done Scorn without the shooting part. Mm. I yeah. think that dragged the game down. I don't think it. It, that it, it had shooting. Mm. Yeah. It should have been an atmospheric puzzle game, in my opinion. Mm. Yeah, Scorn is either A or B tier for me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's not better, in my opinion, than. It's Oi. not better than <laughs> Kibami, at least, too. Visually, please. It's above mm. Blade and Sorcery, yeah. though, I think. So I think it would be behind Kibami, too. Yeah, yeah. I think that's fair. Yeah. Seeker VR. <laughs> oh god. The the classic video. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it, I thought it was very funny. I would recommend it if someone is a Harry Potter fan. Yeah. yeah. And I am a Harry Potter fan. Yeah. Mm. And I enjoyed it. I mm. would probably place it in C tier. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Crazy. Yeah. Above, I think next to Ark. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. Oh, sleigh bells. Oh. I liked sleigh bells. Yeah, it was a fun. Yeah. Like, it, it really captured the 80s feeling. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> like, gameplay wise and, like, musically. Yeah. yeah. Like, the music was really good, in my opinion. Yeah. 
Yeah, I like that. It was fun to like play a very play a very old game. Yeah. Old feeling game. Mm. I mm. think I would put sleigh bills over paper man. Oh yeah. Paper man. Yeah. 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 yeah, I think Sleigh Bells is B tier in my yeah. opinion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. <laughs> this one people oh. might get mad about. <laughs> Sanic. Oh, Sanic. Sanic. Now we have started like Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sonic Adventure 2 Which is, is much better. more fun. <laughs> yeah. It's better gameplay wise and better story wise as well. Yeah. Mm. I would place it C tier. Because it's childhood game. Yeah. It's, it's not bad. It's not bad, but it has not aged well. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'd still put it... I think maybe next to R. The Forsaker. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. Stranded Deep is okay, in my opinion. I think I had more f- Fun playing Stranded Deep than Sonic Adventure. Oh yeah, right. The the ending to Stranded Deep kind of sucks, in my opinion. Mm-hmm. Okay, for the ending, I would place it lower than Sonic Adventure. Actually, is it better than Color Purple? Yeah, um, you can do more in Stranded Deep. Is it better than Seeker? Yeah, it's so it's, it's more of a Sonic. yeah. I would place it behind <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> Subnautica Below Zero, another survival game. Mm. Mm-hmm. Better than Stranded Deep. Yeah. Yeah. Think yeah. I like yeah, Below Zero more than Ark as well. Yeah. yeah, same. Yeah. I think it should go in the B tier. Yeah. yeah, I think Below Zero is B tier. Mm. Maybe above Legends of. Yeah, I think maybe. Mm. <laughs> I, it's just I like Blade of Sorcery more. Yeah, yeah, yeah I did that too. But more. you can uh, do more in uh, do more in yeah the uh, Subnautica. Yeah, yeah. You can do much more. Where did we agree on? Uh, I think before Blade and yeah, Bla- Sorcery. Yeah, uh, sure. Victory. <laughs> 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 uh-huh. The longing. The longing has like it's it's emotional for me. Mm, <laughs> like yeah. it's like ooh, yeah. like I think it really captures that feeling of longing for something like to the point that it it's it fucking hurts, man. Mm, yeah. Uh, the soundtrack is phenomenal. It's really <laughs> good. Yeah. It's phenomenal. Phenomenal. <laughs> 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 I'm yes. trying to sound fancy, okay, yeah. but it's, it's not. Very good, yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's very good music. Good, make, <laughs> booga, make, booga. give me feeling I did <laughs> not know. Booga, booga, feeling good, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I would put the longing in B tier uh-huh. because it's super unique and it. It like it does what it's supposed to do very, very well. It can be very short and long if you want. Mm. I would put it over the Paperman, I think, mm-hmm. because soundtrack-wise, I like it yeah. more. Yeah. I can agree to that. Yeah. Yeah. The Moonlight Circus. Thick clown. Thick clown dude that fucking wanted to murder us. Yeah. Yeah. It gets plus points because he was thick. No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> It had a good uh, sound design, in my opinion. It was pretty good at building the atmosphere. But the uh, gameplay, uh, I did not like the gameplay. <laughs> no. You swung. It was hard to climb. Yeah, climbing was hard, and you swung your arms to move. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The voice acting was really good. Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe C? C? Yeah. I think I'm. Maybe above Seeker VR? Crazy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. Before Seeker. Yeah. The Red Stare. It was a very... It was... Interesting? Yeah, it was interesting, but also annoying. Yeah. <laughs> you kept photographing Curtis. <laughs> yeah, oh, fucking yeah. Curtis. <laughs> You're like, oh, who's that Curtis? Fuck you, Curtis. <laughs> Fuck Fucking leave. I I'd place it in D tier. Yeah. yeah, same. 
I think behind Delta Room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. It yeah. was funnier yeah. than Sabbath Corpse. Yeah. yeah. It had a, it had more uh, meat on the bone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> you know, you had to answer the phone, you could take photos, you had to fax the photos and fucking... Yeah. You yeah. could draw a penis on the <laughs> fucking wall. <laughs> yeah. You made an elephant, <laughs> Santa. <laughs> oh, yeah, fuck <laughs> Now, vacation simulator, uh, finally. I think it should be above job simulator. Yeah, I think it, vacation simulator is A tier. It's a really good VR game. Yeah. It's, it's one of those VR games where it's like, yes, if you're gonna buy your first VR game, you should get, like, job simulator yeah, or vacation simulator. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, A above job. Yeah. Vampire. Hot take. S. Oh. oh, I really liked it. I really liked Vampire too. Yeah, same. I really like the concept of you know like, a doctor mm-hmm. becoming a vampire as a big fan of vampires. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like I'm not a big fan of vampires, but I still fucking love this game. Yeah, yeah. I liked it too. Yeah. Like, people are ri- right that, uh, like, the main fucking opinion on the game overall is that the, the gameplay isn't that great. Yeah. But I think the story and, like... Saves it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, like, the story saves it a lot and it has a really great soundtrack. The mm. characters are very well written. And the choices you make actually matter. Yeah. The concept is so simple, but it works so well. Like, you're a blood surgeon that becomes a vampire. Yeah. And you have to, like, fucking find a cure for the vampire the disease that's spreading throughout London. And I just fucking love it. Yeah. yeah. So and they're I freaking British. <laughs> yeah. It should be an S. Yeah. Yeah, I think. Which all the mean is that bomb. Metal Gear. Ah, oh, shit, people would be so mad. <laughs> you might hate me all you want, but this is happening. <laughs> yep. Okay. Okay, it's, it's Waltz of the Wizard. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's the first... Oh. It's nostalgic Radio. for us, because mm. it's the first game we played for the channel. Yeah. It's our favorite game. Yeah. Like, we... It's... Among really? VR games, it's fucking S tier. Yeah, yeah, it's really good. Because it actually does... Like, Alden, the team behind it, they do everything you fucking can with VR. Mm. Yeah. Like, like it, they actually try to utilize everything. Like, different uh, walking styles, fucking different... Like, fucking summoning spells with your voice. Yeah. And, like, fucking... Yeah. Like, they do so much, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Think I'd place it above Vampire. Yeah. Yeah. But no. Yeah, actually, above Kiwami, I think. Yeah. Because it's a VR game. Yeah, it's easier to like play it. Yeah. yeah. Like you, you can just jump into it and yeah. go ape yeah. shit. <laughs> yeah. Wedding VR. Uh, above Moonlight Circus. Oh. Yeah, that that's my rating. <laughs> How would you <laughs> rate? Mm. <laughs> it's super cringe, but it's good kind of cringe for me. Like it's fun to play because it's cringy. <laughs> mm. Man, that's like D tier worst games. <laughs> yeah. Like I agree on the C tier, but I don't know where. I would put Don- Data over Moon Knight Circle, yes. Okay, uh, do you agree, yeah. Mikael? Yeah. Okay, okay. He was Henry best boy. below Marshmallow. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you want to put I would put Prince him, Henry? like, before Seeker. I would put before Moonlight Circus. Amanda would put... Uh, After Marshmallow. So, compromise is uh, After Seeker? Yes. Okay, Yamato. He was the fuck boy, right? Yeah, yeah he, he was, was the fuck boy. boy that was like a magician. What? No, I think he was a uh, he snapped magistrator. His, he snapped his fingers and you got teleported to the beach and then he summoned balloons and okay. pigeons. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, yeah, he was the one that went down on one knee. <laughs> Oh god, right. Yeah. Oh. Well, Henry fucking hugged you. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's Mary. what I liked about Henry. He was sweet. No. <laughs> that was best though, because he, he was soft, ooh, boy, that protects you. He was respectful. You. 
helpful. Yes. He did not touch. Henry sucks because he we didn't get to marry him for real. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I would it was so weird. I think I would put Yamato over him. Yeah, same. Because yes. he's a fake ass bitch. Yeah. Like Henry. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, nah, we need to prepare you. Yeah. So. <laughs> I feel people are gonna go. <laughs> I don't Delta care. Rune. How dare you put a VR Otome over Delta Rune? <laughs> because I had more fun with it, okay? Yeah. I had fun harassing yeah. I got married to fries. And then we have Wilson's heart. Nobody can tell me I never got married. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wilson's heart is really good, in my yeah. opinion. I would put it at A. Hmm. But after Cat. I would put it in B. Because Wilson's heart has a nice story. It's like uh, very heartwarming when you get to the ending, but yeah. you also feel betrayed. <laughs> First in B tier. Oh. Yeah. oh! I can agree with that. Because I like it more than Subnautica and uh. Sworn. And I don't know about <laughs> Kiwami too, yeah. Yeah, because, you know, we only play too little. Yeah. Okay. Wow, look at this. We are done. Oh my so god. So, should we look it over and see if we... <laughs> yeah, we can look and see if we agree. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. S tier, I think, is fine. I think it's yeah. fine. Like, yeah. It, it looks like, mm, yeah, that that's the ones I like. Mm, yeah, it's good. Mm. And A. A, yeah, it makes sense that Rising is at the top. Yeah. Yeah. B looks fine. B, the winner of B tier is Wilson's heart. Mm -hmm. Pepe Tura at the top of C tier. <laughs> yes, because I say so. <laughs> <laughs> because I said. <laughs> okay, maybe, yeah, I would place Ark higher than Grey, I think. Yeah, I think yeah. so. Too. And higher than uh, Hello Puppets. Yeah. <laughs> now that I think about yeah. it. It's bothering me too. I'm like, I think Ark should yeah, be a Ark, little bit higher. Ark deserves to be higher, but yeah. Paper Tura deserves the top spot because yeah. Ark. Because of the art. art. Okay, Delta Rune, Red Stair, Santa's Corpse, Cuddle Coral. D tier is the weirdest one. Yeah, I'm on about what the hell. But it makes sense, in my opinion. Yeah. yeah. Hooray! We're gonna piss off so many people! Woo! Yay! <laughs> especially Metal Gear fans! Yeah, I'm all my yeah. fucking god. Yeah, especially because we put fucking Vampire before. <laughs> but we. We put Vampire look... before a Kojima game. <laughs> people well, are fight gonna... me! <laughs> people are gonna be super fucking mad, bro. I don't At care. least that means more. And an hours. indie game yeah. studio above Kojima as well. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, memes doesn't save everything, okay? Some might be mad that we put a Sega game above it as well. Maybe not as mad about a Capcom game, but maybe it's Sega. It's a fucking Yakuza game, bruh. Yakuza fucking good, bruh. Yeah. 